Everyone found out you're interviewing Mark. Right. Like, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, is he there yet? Yeah. <laughs> you still have those highlights? <laughs> <laughs>What's really cool is it's really a sort of a 90s nostalgia trip happening. It kind of happens every 15 to 20 years with a decade, you know? It took a little longer with the 90s because it never really ended. The crowds are getting bigger, but they're getting younger too. You come to Under the Sun, I mean, it's about three and a half hours of, of solid hits. And I think that's great. We're not selling anything new. We're not like, here's a new product. If you don't like hits from the 90s, please don't come to the show. We have nothing to offer you. If you do, you can have the best night of your life. Is there a professional sort of scales I do vocally? Like, gee, 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 gee. no, <laughs> you know? You know, a little shot of Jameson and uh, the reaction of the crowd that gets me going every time. That's the time I fall in love again. You know, there's been a few crazy fan experiences that we've never got to the level of hysteria, a little bit in the 90s, but, you know, sort of like where Britney Spears goes through. You know, I never got to that insanity. Thank God, really. But there's been some crazy experiences where uh, I found someone in my hotel room once. I didn't know it was going to be there. That was really creepy. And someone had to sign their wooden leg once. That was interesting. I go, you know, this is permanent ink. It's going to be there forever. You think you're going to love us forever? And he said, yeah. So we... So if you still out there with that sign, it should, uh, Sugar Ray Wooden Leg, I apologize. We hope you're doing all right. You know, it's, it's absolutely Fly. Fly was the song that actually took us around the world. It gave us our first. I will always be humbled by that song. When I hear it on the radio still, it, it feels like the first time. Um, and it's just, uh, it's sort of like a best friend that never went away and is always there. I've got a new EP, the Mark McGrath for solo EP coming out this uh, summer. It's on Pledge Music. Uh, you can go to pledge.com and check that out. It's purely for fun and being creative. You know, I know darn well that our Mark McGrath EP is not going to move the universe, but it's great to have a platform to release new records and new music. And if you're a fan of Sugar Ray, I think you're going to like this.